Okay, we back. Uh, the markets seem that they have hit, have taken some good turns today. Um, NVIDIA is really doing something, but I wouldn't want to concentrate on NVIDIA because NVIDIA, NVIDIA is just, you know, they went all the way down to like 700. So, you know, people lost money, but they aged back up. They're almost at uh, 900 now, you know, it's or somewhere along that line, but they had, they had gotten really in a disastrous area. But then you, when you pay $800 a share, you know, you know, day traders can't lose that kind of money, especially if you're just doing it, you know, first time, you might have three or four shares. You didn't pay, if you got four shares, you didn't pay about a couple of thousand dollars. And all of a sudden they go down, you know, 20 or $30, you didn't lost, a, you lost a couple hundred dollars. Okay. So we're not going to get on that, but we want to, we want to share our screen. Okay. We want to look at this one. Um, because this earnings is next week, and this this is the this they saying this is one of the top stock, but this really has been going backwards. Um, and they said it's got potential. Potential don't mean anything, but this is what this this one we we did it before. Uh, this is Encore, you know, M Encore, and it together subsidy design, manufacturing, fiber, laser, and all this other good stuff. I want you to read about this company. Because it's dealing with sensors and it, it's got a, it's dealing with the, this you know the sales force and it's dealing with third party sales representative, dealing mostly with navigation systems and technical. You know we talking probably more like the military, okay, United States and international, okay. So I want you to we're gonna go back to company overview. It says trading at a good value to its peers in the industry and the analysts is good agreement that that stock and price will rise about 300 and some percent. It's about $2 and 60 some cents now. But it had a run a few months back, a month back. You know, you can see it was about $9 in July, then October of 03, it went, started steady going down. And then it really dipped to about three something. And right now it's at about 297. So it's going backwards. It was all the way up here, you know, last year in May to $10. They get ready to get earnings. And, you know, Zach had this number three on his earnings list. So I let me go through here. They delayed announcement in their um, filing. And now they get ready to have it. I think it's uh, May second, and they hopefully they don't delay it again, because then people start thinking something. You know, people start pulling their money. I got three hundred shares. You know, just in case they do decide they got low flow. There uh, to their peer ratio price to sell, and this is industry. Okay, so they're in the green. Analyst forecast, target price at more than 20% higher in the current share, okay? Future growth, ah, they, they, they lack. I'm going to check it out, earnings, and then I'll pull away. Analyst future growth forecast, this is the company, and this is the industry, okay, in the market. They are unprofitable over the next three years. But, uh, so we're going to see what's going on in the next. Because I'm trying to still figure out why the Zach got them to a buy. Uh, past earnings. Okay. Negative. Okay. Financial health. It's a mixed bag. They got enough money, cash, to do what they need to do. But they need to reduce the debt to equity ratio. Okay. Has been has increased from zero to eleven percent. Stable cash runaway. They got less than a year forecast. They're gonna get money. I'm anxious to see what this forecast is gonna do. That's gonna decide whether I come out of them or not. 
okay? Dividends, you know, management, they got a three out of four criteria. Compensation versus market, that's not good. Jeff, total compensation, 1.2 million, which is above the average, is about 600,000. He's got experience, experience management, and experience board. So yeah, he's got the management in place. This company has been buying up. They bought one point, you know, people get this kind of money and then this is insider, Bradley Randolph, that's the owner. I mean, that's the, yeah, he's not on, he's insider. So you can see people, but it's look, more shares. They buy more. And you can see, I love that ratio because if you think about it's more than the general public shares. So hedge funds, institutions, and insiders and private companies has been buying this particular product. And this company just came in, bought 16.2. He's become the majority shareholder. Okay. And you can see all, you know, Vanguard is in this one. And BlackRock is in it. Not as many, but they buy, you know, more shares. They're increasing their stake in this thing. But you got all look at the big, big boys, foundations, and okay. So let's go back. Let's do a new share. Let's see what's in the market today. Let's see what the market is doing. Okay. Okay. We're going to start with uh, my personal side, the, you know, the smallest amount that I have in here to play my, I call it my play money. Uh, you know, the I put these folk over here, you know, uh I this is the what we just did, this one right here. Uh Emma Core. I got 300 stake in here, 300 shares. Uh CRISPR is starting to come alive. I put I, I put more CRISPR over here on my I said, okay, CRISPR was going kept going down. You know, CRISPR was about 700. That's that uh sickle cell cure, you know. And uh, these guys right here, I put a thousand in this one right here because I this this is the side I, that's going to generate. I think it's going to generate in the next month or so. If it don't, I'm going to be taking all these guys out. Then I'm going to go over here to my. Um, I moved a lot of money out to my other account. This is my uh, business account because they wasn't producing anything. And I needed to, to be able to take the money out quickly because they were going too far under, you know, you know, I'm losing a lot of, I lost $3,000. You know, that's why I got 13 out of 20 in the market right now on this side, my business account. This is the one I'm really looking at. I got a hundred thousand total and I got Intel. I picked up Intel. Intel had earnings and they went backwards. So I, I got in at 31 and they down at 31, low $31 a share. And I, I'm, I'm high on Intel because Intel <laughs> is going to play a role in the U.S. trying to get that manufacturing of chips back. So I'm, I'm really investing in Intel because Intel... It should be around $60 a share or more. They should be competing with AMD. And so I think the United States government is going to do what they did with IBM. And they're going to invest in Intel. Intel still got a good market, but they can't compete with AMD. And even though they're in the AI business, they can't compete right now. Lap. They not doing anything, and the rest of these, you know, Microsoft. I got make. I put Microsoft over on uh, my. I, it's not options, but you know, it's the uh, area that I can get more bang for my buck. This one is doing pretty good today, and uh, T Mobile. They hit earnings, and they they done. These gonna have earnings on the first. That's next week. It's uncommitted, but it's gonna be probably next week. This, they're in phase three. That's an Alzheimer's study, and they, you know, and then TTO. They're still waiting on FDA. These are FDA one phase three. TTO 
and SAVA. I, that's why I got fouls in them. They gonna they gonna fly. They can go to nine hundred in a minute. They're testing this these drugs. VV, okay. They not doing. They they went down. I'm still got about three thousand. I had about eleven twelve. I took it out so I can put it elsewhere and make that money back up. And VXRT, same thing. It's at seventy. Uh, so it's doing what it's supposed to do. Now let's look at the. This is my biggest producer. Is these guys right here, and you can see in uh, Nvidia is went up to eight seventy seven. It's almost hit eight nine. I got about thirteen. They they were really down. They went all the way down. See, I caught them at seven eighty a share. You know, I got out of Nvidia because they were going down. And I got picked them back up uh, yesterday at seven eighty. Now they ate something. They over, um, yeah, they close to a hundred dollars more a share, and you can see that's how much I done made. And I can snatch these out at any minute. I don't have to wait until, you know. But you have to have twenty five thousand. I moved forty. I moved forty thousand into this group right here. Okay, this 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 account. Uh, Amazon is in here. You look at Amazon fifty two. Now it's at fifty seven. Um, Amazon, I sold out of Amazon on the other side and I uh, got it up to now 79. I got it at 72, now it's 79. Uh, Intel, saying, you know, 130, now it's $31 and something. Then you got this one I put it got 17. This is a cryptocurrency one, digital holdings. Look at this. I got two minutes. And then you got Microsoft. I picked it up at 393 is 406. And the big, you know, Nikola, I picked it up at 60. Now I put a thousand. Because they had some criminal stuff going on with their CEO. But now, you know, I picked it up. And this is the electric truck, you know, haul, you know, self-driving and all this other good stuff. And the video, like I say, the video is being the video. They really uh, doing what they supposed to do. Palatar picked them up at 20. Now they're at 22. So I'm making a little money. Rat car. I might take this one out. It's not doing as well, but I, I want to keep, this is the drones. And they got Tesla. Tesla I picked up when they hit down 159. Now they want 68. So I'm still making a little money. So you can see I'm making a little money. And this, this thing is increasing. Okay. So let's look at all of them. I got one minute. Before they stop, you can see, like I said, I lost about well, I had fifteen thousand. Now it's down to fourteen. It's all it was sixteen thousand. Now it's down to a year to gain this year. Six is fourteen. So I'm gonna see what these guys do today. I, I'm I'm back over seventy. I should be up around. Uh, they say it should be about eight eight. You know, eighty thousand. You know, I lost a little money. Cause I put some money in this thing, so we'll see where I, where this goes. Because I don't want to get below seventy. I pull it out if I have to. But these these guys are, I'm dependent on uh, to do something. This one right here, I got a hundred thousand shares and six dollars a share. I expect this one to be a dollar. This all these on the Nasdaq, you know. Um, Nvidia. Oh, it, it was a terrible week last week. You know, you know what? Both of us saw it. it was terrible. Last Friday, I think I lost the bulk of that last Friday. Okay, but now it's four o'clock, and you can see the winner really is Nvidia. Nvidia is seven hundred and fourteen dollars today. I'm over, and it's still going up. And after hours, um, the next one even close to it is uh, Intel got back on track. Okay. NVIDIA is the big winner. Palatar coming in. And then you got you got a lot of good winners. But Amazon. Okay. Let's see what happens. Okay. We're going to stop sharing. Okay, God bless you, God bless you. She's happy. God bless you.
you know, Olivia is happy. God bless you, God keep you. And my uh, my sister, she's out of the hospital. She went home today. So God bless you, God keep you, God call his face shine and give you peace. We're going to try this again Monday. Let's see if it's going to reverse Monday. You know, anything can happen. We're going into May. I think April shower being May flowers. I think these going to really flower up in May. So far, uh, April has not been that good of a month. But the showers, we, when we talk about May is usually the better month for the stock to do some things to make a reverse. So we'll see. Okay, we're going to end it. God bless you.